Thank you, I appreciate it. Thanks to all the partners here who have made this wonderful transit center possible. I'm here today on behalf of Montgomery County Executive Ike Leggett, who unfortunately could not attend. However, if he were here, I'm sure he would share our excitement at the opening of this facility, which will tremendously improve pedestrian safety by consolidating bus stops in one centralized location. Make taking transit easier and even more convenient. Provide a healthy, handy transfer point to the future Purple Line, which direct connection to destination throughout the region and provide many passenger amenities, including real-time bus arrival screen, additional lighting, better circulations, and enhanced passenger shelter benches and waiting area. Improving transit services here and throughout Montgomery County has significant economic benefits for us, the region, and the state of Maryland by attracting new employers and providing better access to new and ex existing jobs through public transportation. Many residents in this area heavily rely on transit and especially benefit from this center. But we all benefit from transit, both transit users and drivers alike. We cannot build enough roads to eliminate traffic gridlock in our region. So when more people take transit, it improves their commutes and the commute for drivers alike. The backbone of our transit system and the essential elements in relieving traffic congestion is Montgomery County's 340 ride-on bus system. Five of the 11 bus routes passing through the center are ride-on routes providing service to thousands of daily passengers. As a multimodal organization, the Montgomery County Department of Transportation is committed to expanding travel option for our residents. And that commitment extends to investing in alternatives. Montgomery County contributed two and a half million dollars to this project, which you already heard from others, is the largest bus-to-bus -bus transfer area in the region that is not located in a rail station. And we are planning even greater investment in transit infrastructure for additional services, including a starting new year, next year, limited stop service on Maryland 355 and bus rapid transit on US 29 in 2020. Montgomery County Department of Transportation is pledged to continue to create the best transportation the best transportation network possible for our community and this transit center is another achievement in building a balanced and comprehensive system thank you